God, Perf Persona 4's intro didn't feel this long. Okay, we're here. This is... This is... Yeah, the station closes to our house. The closest station to their house? Guess they'll be coming here a lot over the next few days. <laughs> yes, you will, son. Yes, you will. I can make so many jokes about this, but... I don't know. This is just wearing me down at this point. Anyway, it's quite late. We'll head straight home tonight and show you around tomorrow. Wow. It's really dark. This is... This is... The town where Makoto and Akira live. Even so... What's wrong? You look so disoriented. It's just a regular suburb. It's not that strange, is it? Well, everything's strange to this guy. He just flips his shit at everything. It sure is. This guy is on fucking believable. This stuff is completely foreign to me. What? What's so foreign about it? Well, like that vending machine over there. It's got juice and cigarettes. Tons of vending machines have juice. I mean, some don't have cigarettes, but that's just because of an ID thing. Maybe there's no age limit on smoking in Japan. I don't know. I don't really care. It's true, but so what? It's the kind of thing you see anywhere. Absolutely not. You don't, I don't think you can find that anywhere but Japan. So, you know, this is going to be great when he encounters the vending machine with the panties in it. And he's just going to be like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Really? Really? At least that's not how it is in my country. You know, the correct one. Anyway, there's so many stores open at this time of night, it's almost like a 7-Eleven. Really? This isn't normal in other countries? Well, it's standard in big cities, you know. But we're in a residential district. Plus, there's one there and one there, too. If I look closely, they all look really similar. 7-Eleven. I have a convenience store near my house. It's called Avondale. I think it's a chain. It's in a suburb. Who cares? I live within walking distance to a grocery store, and I live in a suburb. This isn't uncommon. Yeah, they're conbini. Conbini? It's... Sh oh, sorry. It's short for convenience store. Right. Conbini is short for convenience store, I guess. Yeah, conbini. Convenience. It, they don't sound that uncommon. You can buy things like food and magazines there, even household supplies. It's like a convenience store. Okay, okay, he's acknowledging it now, but he's going to turn around, I'm sure. Well, we do have convenience stores in my country, but... That's right, if you go to a convenience store, you can register and use the Wi-Fi there. At the convenience? Yeah, um, you see the one with the 7 on the sign? You mean the 7-Eleven? Oh, <laughs> I didn't see that coming. I feel bad that I didn't see that coming. I should have seen that coming. But it is, in fact, a 7-Eleven. Which just adds to my point that this guy should not be surprised about any of this. Oh, we have that store in my country, too. It's famous. There's some other places where you can use the free Wi-Fi. Like coffee shops, I think. Yeah. Yeah. But Convenia are open 24 hours, so they're very useful to have around when you find yourself in trouble. Okay, you know what else is useful to have around when you're in trouble? Captain Planet. Really? Hmm. Wait a minute, 24 hours? Well, yeah. These girls are looking at me like I'm crazy. You're not crazy, you're just stupid. But there are so many 24-hour stores and vending machines around. All of these things that would never exist outside Japan... But now that I think about it, I guess it's a sign that this really is a safe area. That's Japan for you. Here we are. This is our home. Come on in. Ugh, my arm's starting to hurt. I've been leaning on it. I, I like. I sit horizontally on like my couch, and I have to adjust a lot so that my arm doesn't fall asleep. But, I mean, I'm just so riveted by this game, I don't even care. Dot, 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 dot. I've heard that you're supposed to leave your shoes by the entrance in Japan. I guess it's true. That's true of a lot of places in North America. That's just being courteous. 
Because your shoes are covered in mud and shit. Maybe literal shit. Who knows? Also, why isn't this going? Oh. My screen was freezing up for a second. It would be embarrassing if I hadn't. This is the living room, and that's the kitchen. Please make yourself at home. Thanks. In exchange, you can't make miss. <laughs> you just watch me. I won't. That's right. Anyway, let's go to your room. Ooh, threesome. This is a Japanese-style guest room. Will it work for you? Dot, 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 dot. <laughs> dot, 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 dot. Um, dot, dot, dot. Wow! Huh? Her... <laughs> A tatami room. A Japanese style room. That's amazing. Can I really stay here? This guy's worse than puppies. Like, oh my god. Like, who would have thought you'd find a Japanese style room in Japan? Like, be polite. Don't be an asshole like this. Um, well, yeah, it's our only guest room. So, like, Makoto's just, like, the straight man in this whole thing. She's probably the least unlikable character in this game. I mean, like, almost by default. Like, because she's just, like, t so taken aback. Like, she's not terrible. She's not an awful person. <laughs> like, the main character, you know, Weeb Trash, he's, like, this naive puppy asshole, you know, guy. And Akira's just a terrible, like, bitch. And I know it's, I know bitch isn't a very good word, but, I mean, there's no other word to really describe her. Makoto just exists. She's, like, the best by default. <laughs> It's like, she's like the 4 out of 10 compared to the 2's. Yes, it's been my dream to stay in a tatami room. Thank you. I see. I'm glad you're happy about it. Anyway, as long as you're here, you can think of it as your room. Make yourself at home. Oh yeah, that reminds me. Makoto! Makoto! What? Um... Where are your parents? I'm gonna stay here a while. I'd, I'd like to introduce myself. It'd be weird otherwise. Oh, our parents aren't here. Oh, this is getting weird. What? Dot dot dot. Um. What 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 did you just say? Our parents were called out of town for two weeks on urgent business because they work at the same business. I guess. That's weird. Such a shame. They really wanted to meet you. Sure they did. Da da da. Well, I mean, they would want to meet me so that I didn't come in with a hacksaw and chop you to bits, but... You know, we can't have what we want. It's like the Rolling Stones said. You know. I forget what the Rolling Stones said. Something about getting something. And not always getting it, but you get things you need. I don't know. This brain makes my game go numb so I'm afraid they won't be back until after you're gone I'm really sorry yeah that that's a face that says I'm sorry anyway I had to help with the dinner preparations could you wait a few minutes and then come to the living room um sure dot 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 their parents aren't here they won't be back till after I'm gone score in other words, the whole time I'm in Japan, the only ones in the house will be Makoto, Akira, and I? That's... That, that's how this is going to work? No way! I mean, it's not like I've done anything to feel guilty about, but... Dot dot dot. I have to stop thinking about this. They've been nothing but good to me. I can't betray the kindness they've shown me, except at the end of the game where I kinda do that. I'm not gonna think about that stuff anymore. I won't think about it. I won't. I'm a gentleman. Yeah. Which is why you're named Weep Trash. A gentleman, a gentleman, a gentleman. This is how he like gets his boner down. Wow! Check out this spread! The table's covered in food! I know, right? Aki-chan's been slaving over it all day. What? what? I, I was not. I wasn't slaving over anything, Bakakun. Of course you weren't. I won't say anything more about it. Dot, dot, dot. You really should be more honest. Hmm, what's wrong? Nothing. I, I just... 
<laughs> That's Brandon here. I prepared all this food. No, it's just I didn't expect it. It's the same as being surprised. That's true. But either way, Makoto seems like she ought to be the cook in the family. Anyway, I don't care. If you're anxious about it, you don't have to eat. Actually, a uh, comment on that last line. Um, if you think Makoto's the one who should have been cooking, you've never met chefs. I'm not anxious. It's just you've been working on it since morning. I have to eat it. I told you, I didn't particularly work hard on it or anything. God, why won't Senpai notice me? Now let's toast to your first day and our first meeting together. And cheers. Cheers. Fine, cheers. There's plenty of food, so please eat until you're full. Okay, that's good. I was only going to eat till I was sort of hungry. Oh my god, I've been going at this for like 30 minutes. Okay, um, uh, oh, uh, that's right. There's something Japanese people say before eating, isn't there? Before eating? You mean it, uh, itadakimasu? Yeah, that's it. Itadakimasu is an expression of thanks for the beings that gave up their lives, the people who raised them, the people who made the food. An expression of thanks, huh? What a nice word. That's right. So you need to fill it with gratitude toward Aki-chan, who worked so hard on make this food. Yeah, I told you, eh. Well then, officially with gratitude towards Akira. Itadakimasu. Itadakimasu. <laughs> Itadakimasu. <laughs> You're so shy. Hey, uh, uh, you. You start eating already, too. I know. Uh, anyway, how? <laughs> how is it? Mm. Da -da -da -da. It's great. This is amazing. Isn't that nice, Aki-chan? You ain't saying it to me. Because you're the one who made it, dumbass. It's true, but your cooking is amazing, Akira. I can hardly believe it. But you don't look like a cook, right? Oh, well, you kind of do. It's not what I'm saying. Really? You, you weren't thinking that? Of course not. Take some pills. Get some medication. Go to some therapy. You obviously have some deep-seated problems. Actually, I was thinking it a little. Me? <laughs> um... You still did that. Hmm? Boom, stunt him less, you can say if you want more. Akira. Me? Mm -hmm. Sure, thanks. <sighs> the food Akira made sure was delicious. And I even got to take a Japanese style bath, which is exactly like a regular bath. The washroom is kept separate from the bathtub. I guess people here really do use the bathtub for daily relaxation. I never thought a bath could feel so good. Oh yeah. I was even more surprised to fill, uh, that you could fill it with hot water with the touch of a button. They said you could just touch a panel in the kitchen and it fills with hot water to the proper level. Japanese people are obsessed with the idea of the bath. But it feels so amazing, I can hardly blame them. Oh, God, it's still going. <sighs> wow, the heat from the bath made me so sleepy. Now that I think about it, I didn't sleep on the plane at all. Yeah, we've been over this. I can spend a nice night on my futon. But before that, I should charge my cell phone. Good thing I brought an A-Type 100-volt adapter and plug for Japanese outlets. Now to set the charger. Okay, this should do it. I'm going to make the most of my day in Tokyo tomorrow. Tokyo, huh? I wonder what's waiting for me out there. I've got to fill the album of my mind with all kinds of sights and information. Having a camera helps, too. It's going to be so much fun. Dot, 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 dot. And here we are. Day one has concluded. Or rather, we're going into day one. I don't know. Whatever. Okay, you know, I'm going to stop now because I'm sick of this game. And yeah, here's the save I had previously. I'm going to overwrite this. Um, yeah, watch the next part.